North Korean leader Kim Jong-un will visit Russia for a summit with President Vladimir Putin, the countries confirmed on Monday. The pair will meet for what could be a landmark summit amid Moscow's deepening isolation over the war in Ukraine. The Kremlin says Kim will visit Russia in the coming days at the invitation of Putin, while North Korean state news agency KCNA said the two would meet and have a talk without elaborating. The summit is likely to take place on either Tuesday or Wednesday in the far eastern city of Vladivostok. Residents there seemed intrigued by the prospect of his arrival in the city. North Korea is such an isolated country. Maybe they will be friends with us, but not likely with the US. Both Russia and North Korea bear their teeth to the world and can stand up for themselves. So there is something in common. North Korea is one of the few countries to have openly supported Russia since the invasion of Ukraine last year. And Putin pledged last week to, quote, expand bilateral ties in all respects in a planned way by pooling efforts. Kim rarely travels abroad and, when he does, it's often shrouded in secrecy and security. His last trip abroad in 2019 was also to Vladivostok for his first summit with Putin. Officials and analysts have said a Kim-Putin summit would likely focus on military cooperation and, possibly, a deal to supply arms. The United States has said talks for North Korea to provide Russia with more weapons are advancing, despite repeated denials from both Pyongyang and Moscow. The US has said that Pyongyang would be making a huge mistake and would pay a price if it handed over arms to use in Ukraine.